All right, guys, today I'll be showing you how to get the gun belt on any outfit, and I will show you how to create your own police outfit. So the first thing you need to do, you want to delete all your outfits except for one. You want to equip the outfit that you want to keep. Once you do that, you want to go to online. You want to go to swap characters. So once you're here, you want to make sure that your second character is a female character. And then your first character is a male character. If it's not a female character, make sure you delete the second character and create a female character. Once you do that, you want to make sure you copy the rank when it asks you. So once you copy the rank, you want to go online. So once you're back online with a female character, you want to go to the front desk. You want to go to the standard outfits. You want to purchase the first outfit. So you want to purchase this outfit. So you want to make sure you take away the earrings. Then you want to go to the necklace and you want to purchase number 11, the white mm -hmm. necklace. The white pearl necklace. Glad you found what you were looking for. So then you want to go to the front desk and you want to save it in your second slot. Then you need to create a second outfit. So you want to go to the tops. You want to go to working jackets. And you want to purchase number 38. So once you purchase number 38, then you need to go to the gun running t-shirts. And you want to purchase number 60, which is the last one. The blue digital t-shirt. Then from there, you want to go to the pants. You want to go to sport pants. And you want to purchase the first one. Then you want to go to high heel boots. And you want to purchase number 24. Make sure you come back. Then you want to go to the accessories. You want to go to the earrings and you want to purchase number 40. Then you want to go to the gloves and you want to purchase number 32. Those are selling like hotcakes. Then from there, you want to save this in your third slot. So once you save it, you need to take the easy way out. But now since the update, you can't do it through your regular interactional menu. So you need to go to like to the um, pause menu because they don't have it no more to take it out in the new update. So you want to go to um, options and you want to take it the easy way out through there. So once you're back, you want to go to online and you want to go to creator. So 
So what you need to do right now is go to create a race. You want to set tutorial. Now you got to go back to your pause menu and go to swap characters, choose characters. Now what you need to do right now is make sure you delete the second character, which is the female character. If you're on PS4, you need to press circle and it will take it to story mode. If you're on PS5, you need to join Anawak. I'll leave the name in the comment section. And if you're on Xbox, you need to join a friend in a different targeting mode. And that will take you to story mode. So like I said, like if you're on PS4, all you need to do right now is just press circle and that will take you to story mode. So once you're in story mode, what you need to do is go online. You can go to invite only. So once you're back online, you want to make sure you save the outfit that you wanted to keep. You can save it in slot number 18. So once you save the outfit, you should be having the two um, saved outfits that you save with the male character in your settings, just like I have right there. So you want to make sure you equip the first one, number one. You want to equip that outfit. As you guys can see, I have both badge. I have the AI and the cop badge. So right now I'm going to show you the pants that you need to buy to make your cop outfit. So you want to go to the chinos you want to purchase a navy you want to go to the tuck service t-shirts and you want to purchase on um, the black one or the black one with the short sleeve number 27 then you want to uh, equip some boots You want to go to the boots and you want to purchase number 16. Then you want to go to the um, helmets and you want to go to riot helmets. You want to purchase the ones that say police on it which is number 22. Your <laughs> so now what you need to do is go to your pause menu and you want to start the mission as a G thing. So once you're here, you want to make sure that you change this to player safe outfit. Then you want to invite one friend. So once your friend joins, you want to press play. So once you're in the screen, you want to press one to your right and then twice to your left. And just like that, you have the gun belt and both badges. Then you want to ready up. as you guys can see I have the gun belt with the both badges so what you need to do right now is save this outfit make sure you don't save it in your first or second or third slot 
So like that, you could keep doing this glitch and keep getting the gut bell or any other outfit that you guys like, or you could keep switching it up anyways. But if you get like some joggers or something like that. So once you get to your apartment, you want to enter your apartment. You want to save this outfit. So yeah guys, like I said, make sure you don't save it in your first, second, or third slot. So you guys can always have the setup and keep doing this glitch, keep getting the gun belt and everything on any other outfits. So once you save it, you want to make sure you quit this job through your phone. So once you're back online, you want to quit the outfit that you just saved. So as you guys can see, I have the gun belt and both badges. So yeah, guys, it's really easy to do this glitch. It's not really hard. So I'm just going to wear the helmet real quick so you guys can see the how it looks, the outfit. And like I said, as long as you keep those slots saved like you have them right now, you could keep doing this glitch, keep getting the gun belt and all the badges on any other outfit. So I hope you guys like the video. Subscribe, like, and peace.